Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Blocks Pile. On today's brand new video, Shinobi Life 2 was the best Roblox game. Here's how. The first reason why this game is the best Naruto game ever made is because of the fact that it's well made. We can see in the game that the developers put a lot of effort into it because of the amount of tasks, options, and many other things that you were given. Although the graphics aren't that good in this game, we can see that the gameplay balances it out. There's a lot of quests to do and there's a lot of grinding to do and it makes the game overall very, very fun. You will definitely get a lot of experience out of this game and you'll get plenty of hours as well out of this game. 70, I'll, I'll try my luck. I'll try my luck with you. Boop. All right, and now for my final move. Oh God, stop, I can't move. Boop. I hit him, he's dead. Ha <laughs> Bro, why? Uh, uh, bah! <laughs> hit you with one of those. All right, I'm gonna actually do the now the second reason is actually the gameplay. The game has very good physics and players really love the simulations because of how accurate it is. The game has very simple mechanics making it simple for players to understand and people mainly love the game for that specific thing. Comparing to, to other Naruto games or even anime games on Roblox, Shinobi Life 2 has the best overall mechanics and he is actually quite surprised over the fact that this game is popular and did not win a single Bloxy award. This game definitely deserves one for how accurate it is to the anime and very fun. Fucking uh, innocent man. Come up, San Shinobi S have been hiding around around these areas. Can you defeat them? Yes, of course. You don't know what that means? There's different villages. There's a hidden leaf village. There's a sand village. There's the, the village hidden in the mist. There's a few of them. There's a few of them in one of me. Let me just try it. Okay. Reason number three is the player count. Compared to other Naruto slash anime games on Roblox, Shinobi Life 2 has a pretty high player count, which means that people won't have to worry about playing by themselves. You can also invite your friends into your lobby and you guys could grind together. You can also fight other players or even team up with them. Although interactions is not really the main point of the game, you could still try to do some teamwork with other people, and that's what really is very fun. It helps you in the process of getting a level higher, actually. This game's player count also has been heavily impacted by YouTubers playing the game and giving it the recognition that it deserves. Good for you, Shinobi Life 2. You actually can eat ramen. I'm, I'm so starving. This ramen is delicious. Thank you. Does it, I think that actually heals you too. Reason number four is the game is actually challenging. Shinobi Life 2 has a lot of bosses to fight and it isn't so easy to level up because it requires you to be a specific level to unlock a specific quest or an item. This is actually what makes the game very unique because if you team up with other players, it can really boost you up and when fighting bosses or tailed beasts in the game, it's actually pretty hard to do and it's what make people get back into the game for another attempt if they fail. I personally think that developers made the game challenging in order to keep players playing the game, but some did quit because they found it to be a little bit difficult. And finally, reason number five is that the game is actually very accurate to the anime and it's even got a copyright issue. According to a news article, Roblox recently deleted one of its most loved games, Shinobi Life 2, from its website and removed it from all other online stores. Fans of the online game were extremely upset following this sudden step being taken by the game online platform. Many fans took to Twitter to express their discontent and very disappointment when they tried to log into the game and found out it was deleted. Viz Media owns the English publishing rights to the anime series. When Viz Media realized that the game had violated its copyright laws, they reportedly contacted Roblox, who immediately took action and removed the game. As a result of this, players lost access to the game, the group, and even the test servers. Everything that the players had worked hard on for months was lost in merely a matter of seconds. But the bright side is that the game was so accurate in many ways to the anime, and it was the best Naruto game that has ever been on the Roblox platform. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care.